If I'm experiencing physical pain in my body, pain, pain in my body, that is a big indicator that I'm denying my emotions. Right? Any physical pain whatsoever, any disease, any sickness, anything like that, it's an it's a indicator straight away I'm denying an emotion right now, whatever that emotion is. So who feels a bit tight here in the chest area or just in the throat area? Denial of some emotion. Tight in the chest area, like not being able to breathe. Tight in this area, not being able to breathe properly. A lot of people have that. Denial of fear, denial of emotion. Right? A lot of problems down in the bow area, you know, like that seems to be a very popular thing nowadays, right? <laughs> and it is because it's caused by all sorts of feelings of unworthiness and all those kind of things. Denial of another emotion. Can you see it's all period pain, period pain for ladies. Denial of emotions. Once you stop denying your emotions about it, you won't experience the pain anymore. Do you have to find out what that it's linked to or just be aware that you're... Well, if you don't deny the pain and you allow yourself to fully experience the pain, very shortly thereafter, generally, you'll go into the emotion. Okay. And so the emotion will automatically pop up. You don't have to find it in your mind. All you need to do is experience it and it will automatically fly. Is that yep. Yeah. I just sort of, I just sort of sat there and tried to feel, and it's just it's a long time, and it's something you get used to after a while. Yeah, headaches are a big indicator that you're denying lots of sadness and grief, as are uh, sinus issues and sinus problems. So it's not just necessarily an allergy? There are so, no such thing as allergies. Now, that's coming from a guy who has spent most of his life taking allergy medication. <laughs> so I've been there, right? Wow. So, but there's no such thing as allergies. All your allergies disappear when you face the emotions that create them. Yeah. Can you just take, because like, I've just got stuck with the process of trying to, like, be with the headache and what's this about? No, 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 don't, don't even need to go what it's about, even, almost. All you need to do is feel like... Any pain, just remember, any pain, I am denying something. I am wanting to shut down something. Right? And my body is expressing it in pain. So when I've got a headache, I am, all I need to be aware of is I am denying it. I am denying an emotion. I am choosing to deny an emotion. And I'm allowed to. <laughs> and you find that after that, you might find the emotion starts coming up. You're allowed to deny your emotion. Totally. You have free will, right? So do you go to the headache pain and that's where it shows up what you're denying? Or if you just allow the experience and just say this headache, this headache is caused because I'm choosing to shut down another emotion. And so I'm choosing this headache. Right? So I'm choosing the headache. And I'm allowed to choose the headache. Do I want to choose the headache anymore? Who's sick and tired of choosing the headaches? <laughs> so start dealing with what's underneath your emotion. <laughs> you know what I mean? Choose, choose differently. Yeah. Physical pain, big indicator that you're in, that you're in a, a denial state of an emotion. And don't criticise yourself for it. You're allowed to be in a denial state. Aren't you? you? Have free will. You're allowed to be there. This is just to make you, help you become aware. I've got physical pain. I'm in a denial state. I'm allowed to be in a denial state. 